Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Bought a Fractal Audio FM3 a couple of days ago and some of you may have seen the first uh, video I made with it. I was not too impressed with uh, what happened on that day. But I've also ordered the Laney uh, FLR112 specifically voiced for uh, guitar modelers and I'm really excited about it. I'm, I'm really curious how it will uh, sound in comparison to the electro voice so when i got that i can do a video to compare uh, the two after my uh, first frustration and uh, the the four tones that i tried to uh, come up with i decided to create just one patch uh, for the band that i would use the fm3 for uh, which is called project 80 uh, and we play sort of rock versions of 80s new wave songs so normally I use my Koch amp and uh, some pedals and that gives you just one basic sound for all of the songs which makes things more consistent uh, I think. So that's what I try to do with the FM3 now. I uh, came up with one solid patch that covers 80% of the sounds I need and then I will make a few variations on that patch so that it will be one amp with pedals exactly like the well the real stuff so i've done that and i will quickly run through the patch it's a very straightforward simple patch and it's based on a friedman amp all right to create this patch i'm using my uh, siggy brown custom shop heavy relic s-type guitar available at soundwise of course Oh yeah, by the way, uh, since we're here, you may have noticed that I'm quite busy on this YouTube channel the last couple of weeks. Of course, this is for a reason. I, I really enjoy doing this and getting some information across and receiving some information back. And like every other YouTube channel, I would really appreciate it and it would help me if you would leave a comment uh, and consider subscribing to the channel because that would really inform me that what we're doing here is something that people might like and it would motivate me to upload uh, more of these videos because some of you guys might know that is it's a lot of work and some of these videos I've done especially the ones uh, with uh, the covers of the songs it's so much work and it it is really motivating if people subscribe or leave a nice comment uh, or a bad comment if you uh, think I've done a bad job yeah maybe consider that Okay, back to the patch. So there you go, um, I've pulled up FM3 edit <clears throat> and the, the patch is straightforward. I mean, for the guys who know the, the way Fractal works, uh, this is your AM block. It's highlighted, so it's opened. There's a drive block here as well, which is not used for the moment. So uh, for an AMP, I've picked the Friedman BE uh, V2. Saturated uh, overdriven amp. I don't think I've done much to the to the amp. Uh, hang on, this is the reverb. Excuse me. There you go. I think. <coughs> hang on. No, I'm just checking. No, no, no. In this region, 8K, we got some, we got these nasty FR, FR frequencies. So I found that if I lower them a bit, it sort of takes that harshness out of the sound. I don't think it's because of bad design, but I think it's because of the fact I'm listening to an FR, FR speaker, so I'm really Curious how the Laney will uh, cope with that. Yeah, it sounds really nice if I sort of lower those high frequencies a bit. Let's save that. So that's the amp. 
The cap, I've used two caps. One is a PIG 57, a 1x4, and then I got a 4x12. Uh, 300 watt. And the level of the 4x12, I've lowered that a bit, and I've lowered the high cut on the 4x12 as well. liking that and I've got a very straightforward mono analog delay as you can see 500 milliseconds and the mix is only 8.2 percent but sounds like enough to me and then uh, a room reverb <laughs> around 25% and that's it so that's my basic patch and I've made a second scene where I've added some chorus yeah I find this this fractal edit so much more intuitive uh, everything seems to be where I think it should be and everything seems to work the way I think it should work so I'm, I'm really happy and I mean even changing the layout of the uh, the pedals is logical to me. I, don't, I never get lost, which is rare for me. So this is the same patch, but then with chorus. It might be a bit much for now, but I'm just gonna leave that and tweak it uh, when we do the rehearsals. So what chorus have I got? Another analog chorus. Uh, yeah, the mix of fifty percent. <clears throat> yep. Pretty straightforward, bit of drive. So yeah, nothing fancy, but it sounds fantastic. So this is what I, this is what I meant in the other video about uh, the whole thing being very straightforward. You pull up an amp, you pull up a cap lock, couple of effects, delay, reverb, in this case, an extra chorus, and you have a great sound straight away. That's what I want from these kind of units. So now I'll give you some sounds of this patch in the context of a song.
bitch Cause I can like a leech you on everyone to act like you Cause I ask what you bitch so you can get rich But your boss can switch her off you Well you'll work harder with a gun in your back For a bowl of a rice a day Slave for soldiers till you starve 